Hello and welcome. In this video, I wanted to show you what you can do if you have a corrupt USB drive or USB hard disk, which in Windows will show up as raw device. So I have this USB stick here and if I connect it to my computer and I will have a look to the Explorer, um, to my PC and it won't show up here. In such cases, it's always a good idea to check the disk management of Windows. Right click on the start menu and select disk management. This will open the disk management management after a few seconds and you can see all connected hard drives and disks here. We have disk zero, disk one. These are both my internal hard disks and disk two, that's a removable device with 30 gigabytes. And as you can see, there's no file system here like NTFS, XFAT or FAT32. It just shows raw. Raw means the file system is basically broken and we cannot access the files on the device. And it also has no drive letter like C or E. And if I want to assign a drive letter here, I can do that by right clicking and change drive letter and path. And as you can see, there's an error message. The system cannot find the file specified. So if I have important data on that USB stick, how can I recover it? Well, first of all, the amount of data you may recover or may not recover, it really depends how the damage is on the USB stick. For example, if this is a really corrupt USB stick or USB hard disk, well, then it may be that you cannot recover anything. So a backup is always better than data recovery. Well, let's go to the recovery part. The recovery part we will do with the free open source software test disk. It's a free software you can download from this site here. I will put the link into the video description. And it's a free software, you can download it and it's available for different operating system for Windows, for Linux, for macOS, and also older operating systems. It's basically just a zip file and you have to unzip the zip file and then you can run the application. It's basically a portable application. You don't have to install anything. So there, there are two applications in here. It's photorec underscore win. That's the command line version. And we want to use the UI version. So just double click it and acknowledge to start the application. Here it is. And we close the windows and the program is very simple. You just have to select the drive here from which you want to uh, recover files. In our case, it's our physical drive too. As we remember from the disk management that we had three drives connected to our computer, disk zero, one, and two. Disk two is our removable device. And it's the same here. Physical drive two, as you can see, 31 gigabytes. Intenso Ultra Line. This is my USB stick. Okay, select the partition here. We only have the raw partition. And the next thing we need to do is uh, to select the destination where we want to save our recovered files. Okay, we select the destination for our recovered files. Let's use C recover. That's a folder I have created on my hard disk. Select folder and it will show up here. You can also select file formats, file formats you want to recover. So you can see there's an extensive list of different file types. The software is able to recover. And for example, if you know that you only want to recover JPEG files, you can untick all the other files here. The default is all files are ticked on and all files will be recovered and then you can sort out from the results later. Okay, let's leave it to the default and then we have to start the recovery process just by clicking the search button here. And we see a progress here and also some files will show up here, for example, in different file types that are or have been recovered already. For example, .exe files, ELF files, PNGs, and all the other things here. Um, as far as I remember, the stick was last used as a Linux ins install stick. So there are a lot of Linux files here. Basically, what the software does is it just searches the entire space of the drive 
four files and restores them to our folder we just have selected. If we have a look to our folder here under C recover, there are the recovered files. So different folders here. And the software will put all files that the software was able to recover into these folders and we can sort out what we need later. The entire recovery process will need some time, so be patient. It depends on the speed of your USB port and also the USB drive as well as the size of the USB drive. But as you can see, we already have recovered, uh, recovered a lot of files here and all these files will be put in our recover folder. As you can see, the folder structure cannot be recovered, only files. So. After the whole process is done, your job is to have a look to each of these folders and look for the files you need and you want to recover. That's a little bit of work, but um, at least you will be able to recover the files from your raw USB stick. Well, and that's it. Just use the software test disk. I've used the software a lot of times and Usually you can recover a lot of files unless the USB stick is completely broken. Okay, that's it. Goodbye.